three years ago, I was basically um, just living my life. For me, I didn't have faith. I didn't know who Christ was or who God was. And the state of my life was, it was a state of just selfish living. And it was all about me. Three years ago, our marriage from the outside looked pretty much perfect. We had um, my older son, then we had my youngest. We had just had our baby, and we spent a lot of time together as a family. And to me, that was different than what I grew up with. So I felt like I was doing good because I had an education, I had a degree, I had a good job. We put a lot into material things and thought that that made us okay, but inside it wasn't quite going so well. Our marriage was basically one step away from divorce. We were having a very, very, very rough time. We were separated. We didn't know where we were going. We were broken and lost. One day, we heard through a third party of a program here at Central Christian Church called Celebrate Recovery. I came home and I told Amy about it, and we were totally apprehensive about it because it was at a church. We didn't believe in God. We didn't know Christ. and. But yet, we were like, you know what, we can still go here, and we can ignore if they start talking about God, and maybe just get the self-help stuff. I was really um, scared and really angry with him that I had to be there too, because I had put, um, he was the bad guy in our relationship, I had put all the blame onto him, and I didn't want to come back. I was pretty sure I wasn't going to. The speaker got up to teach about this lesson on forgiveness and amends, and Amy and I were sitting there, we were just kind of counting the time of when we could get out of this place because we didn't like it. It felt very new and uncomfortable. And, but something happened as he started talking about and sharing his own life, something inside both of us just went off and said, wow, maybe we do need to be here. Maybe we do need to come back one more week. He had shared a lot of the same issues that we did. And uh, another couple shared also how the last year of Celebrate Recovery had changed their marriage. And that's the one thing that really caught my attention and um, made me open to coming again because somebody had their marriage saved and that's what I wanted. We decided to come back and we kept coming back the following weeks. Um, we kind of weren't all in on it. Our life and our marriage still was totally in ruins, we were separated still, not knowing if we were gonna work it out. But as time went on, I really realized that I had my own issues that I needed to work on and that it wasn't all him, so it was really a place for me to be and to have safety as well. Something happened through the course of that six months where there was people brought in my life who were showing me Christ. Something just transformed about the same time with each of us where we started to be open. And I remember having a conversation one night where we talked and we're kind of like, maybe we do believe this. And it happened at the same time, which was a good thing. One day I finally just went home and I decided to get on my knees. I was in the bathroom upstairs in our bathroom and I was just alone in the house and I decided just to get on my knees and, and I just asked God into my heart. I just asked him to show me if he's real to change my life. And from that moment, things really, really took off in my life personally, in my walk, and then in our marriage as well and in our family. We just started connecting in a different way. Our marriage really began to get just pieced back together and it's hard to explain because I can't explain how it happened but everything just really shifted after we accepted Christ and we began getting involved in church and it just everything with recovery became easier and things just started um, turning out to be the way I'd hoped. For me loving your neighbor means um, giving back what God's already given to me. I received the gift of grace and through Celebrate Recovery through our journey and now I'm learning to give back to our neighbors by giving what I received. I don't know where I would have been if there wouldn't have been the Ministry of Celebrate Recovery for me to come to. I don't know where our marriage would have been. Um, I don't know if it would have been together and I don't know where I would have been as a person. Just most importantly, I just feel like I have a purpose being here in this world, a purpose. And that's through Christ, through God.